my grandfather bought this place in 1936 and started raising strawberries and then in 1960 my dad took over then I took over in 2000. Now, uh, strawberries is our main crop, uh, but we grow uh, uh, we grow quite a few blackberries and blueberries, and then we also do quite a few vegetables. Uh, we like the root feed, uh, the urea mate, harvest more. Uh, we use a little bit of your Excite and Enlarge. Bioforge is always uh, a real good product, and uh, we use a little nitrate balancer. Mm -hmm. We go by acres. Uh, everything I like to measure in acres. We get uh, we're probably about sixteen thousand five hundred plants to the acre. We would be happy if we could pick uh, a flat of berries is eight pounds. So we would be happy if we could pick twelve hundred flats to the acre. We were excited. Well, then when I started working with some of the Stoller products and you know uh, starting a little earlier, finishing a little later, uh, in the production mode, uh, right at the peak of the season. Now we're sitting a little bit over 3,000 flats, which is which is almost unheard of in this part of the country. We're in Alvin, Texas. We're not supposed to raise strawberries here. Uh, the strawberries we we uh, actually dip some excite in our root dip before we plant the plants. Okay. We uh, we dip them with that, and it gets them off to a good start. We can actually uh, see white roots in three days after using your excite. And then after that, we start uh, within 10 days, we start injecting. Um, uh, we use a lot of BioForge right at first, and then the uh, root feed mm -hmm. and the urea mate right away within two weeks. Okay. After we get the plants kind of where we want them, then we want to start putting them in the, the fruiting mode. And so we use the nitrate balancer, and then that seems like that kind of kicks it off. It starts mm -hmm. fruiting them pretty good. Towards the end of the season, the plants get a little wimpy, you know, they've been, you know, we pick on them for six months, they start getting towards the end of the season. Um, the last two or three weeks that I see, I'll put a little uh, Excite in Enlarge and I can I can go for a couple more weeks, which in berries and any kind of crop, a lot of times the last two weeks of your season is where you actually make your, put the money in your pocket. Uh -huh. So that's always helped us because we used to get through by the 1st of May and now uh, it's not uncommon for us to go to the 20th of May, even the 1st of June, because we put a little excitement in large.